Welcome back. KTSM is your local election headquarters and today is the last day you can register to vote in Texas ahead of the November 5th election. And joining us this morning is LULAC's National Vice President Mr. Ray Mancera talking about their new efforts to encourage Latino voters to register and vote. The campaign is called Turn Your Power On. Good morning Mr. Mancera. We appreciate you coming down yes. here and talk about something very important uh, for everyone in this country. So tell us a little bit about the campaign I wanted to ask you why is it so important to go out and vote not just as a Latino voter but any voter whatsoever that's right Carla it's not important uh, uh, the black vote or the Hispanic vote of course it is important every American should be voting mm -hmm. but the Latino vote has uh, traditionally been very low in the uh, as far as their turnout for mm -hmm. the elections and that is time to change that it is sad that especially in El Paso majority and in, in, in Texas now we're a majority minority uh, uh, state. Mm -hmm. uh, come on, give me a break. We have to go out there and vote. Vota, por favor. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. That's a great message for sure. Now, I wanted to ask you about a little bit about sort of the young vote. There's a lot of folks out there, Democrat, Republican, white, Latino, black, Native American, doesn't matter. It seems like amongst young people, there's a lot of folks that think, hey, my vote it doesn't really matter. Millions of people vote. Why does my vote matter? And I want to ask you that same question. Why does every vote matter? You know, it's hard to uh, run down the list of 152 reasons why you should mm. vote. Uh, but traditionally, as you know, once you get married or get older, you buy a house, a car, you start being much more responsible. Yeah. And of course, you want to realize that you realize that's something called taxes. And <laughs> oh you want to go, why is this? <laughs> why is the road this way? Why is the economy such in such a way? Of course, that's why people that are older are the ones that are more concerned about voting. Uh, but as far as the uh, young people, I think they're starting to realize, and I'm delighted they are starting to Get, get very involved in the elections mm -hmm. um, for whatever reason. It mm -hmm. might be climate change, it might be whatever. But I am excited about the young vote. They are turning out to vote. Mm -hmm. The Latino vote is the one that I think has been energized recently. So, uh, mi gente, you have to go out and vote. But the impact that your vote has for not voting or for voting, mm -hmm. it does affect both sides mm -hmm. uh, either way. So, the apathy. Uh, of the Latino vote for para que? Why should I? Yeah. Uh, it's uh, you, you, it's hard to answer that question. Honestly, you go like, you know, mm -hmm. hit them over the head. <laughs> there, but what do you mean por que? <laughs> well, of course you have to vote for the well-being of your children, your your family, your your, your job, for whatever reason. But it's hard to have that bridge between our daily life and the actual act of voting. And those of us involved heavily in the community, of course, we see the. Uh, the, the, the the relationship is so strong, mm. but the average voter sometimes doesn't. So LULAC's making an effort to uh, again, one more time, one more year, saying, "Vota por favor, mm -hmm. please vote." Uh, and today's the last day that you yes. can actually you still have to vote. Time. So uh, I was going to ask you, you guys have some great resources as well. And I, I know for a lot of voters, it might be overwhelming, and maybe they they don't like politics, they don't follow politics. So hey. Who should I vote for? Why? What's going on? What should I be looking at? You have something uh, really cool on your website as well. Th that's right. So uh, LULAC has been have they have a tremendous effort nationwide. We are uh, celebrating several celebrating 95 years of mm -hmm. existence. So we've been around a few years. Uh, this is nationwide. But we are delighted that in El Paso, uh, also we have the League of Women Voters th that is trying to help out to get the, the, the vote out. Uh, but LULAC this year is, is very energized because ya basta. We've been out, uh, uh, out of the, uh, on the losing end on many things, so it is time to vote. But the apathy, uh, there's no, there's, uh, how can you fight that? But the young boy is going to be critical. Mm -hmm. um, Mr. Mansara, thank you so much for joining us. We really appreciate your time. We are excited. Remember, today is the last day you can register to vote here in Texas. Lots of places will help you out with that application up until 5 p.m. today. You still have time. All right, we'll be right back here on KTSN 9 News Today.